Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Z Tizzle, and today you can't really see this, but I'm playing some Injustice, and I'm just gonna be doing a quick little kind of gameplay commentary on this Injustice gameplay. So I've got two matches here. Um, one, the first one is against Flash, and the second one is against. Um, I'm not sure who it's against. Let me check real quick. It is against. I don't even know. We'll know, but um, here I'm playing against Flash. I'm using Green Arrow. Green Arrow is really my favorite character. Um, I do really like his combos. As you can see, one here, it is where I hit him against the, uh, I don't even know what to call it, hit him against the invisible wall, I guess, and then uh, shoot an ice arrow at him, and then hit him with the spinning bow thing. I think that was pretty cool. It doesn't do that much damage, but it does look pretty cool. And um, one really helpful thing to do with Green Arrow is to use the invisible arrows to help you get a um, help you get a combo. As you can see here, I'm using the um, the what are they called? Fire arrows, and they're they're the best arrows actually. They do the most damage. But um, as you can see here, I pull out my ice arrow and I fail a little bit. But um, this is also probably my favorite map, probably because it's got. Um, so many, um, what are they called? So many interact interactables on the, uh, like on the map. Like you can shoot these missiles, which I do a lot. Uh, you can throw those gas tanks, like I did earlier. And here's me doing the combo. And here is a wager. I can't remember. I think it was a tie, but I'm not sure. We'll see, I guess. Oh no, I lost. That sucks. But, um,. I do, again, I do like Green Arrow He's g because he does a lot of ranged attacks, like, um, the, like, the arrows, but that's, well, that's the only thing he does that's ranged. And, like, these fire arrows, they each do, I think it's 8% damage, which is pretty good, and the shock arrows are second best, and then the ice arrows just freeze them. But here I've almost got him, I think I, this might kill him. Nope, I didn't do the spinning bow, whatever you want to call it. There it is, I kill. I end up with the spinning bow. So here is the next match. Um, I can't remember what level he was, but... Um, he w Oh, he was only level 14, he was a noob. But this guy's a level 23, we're the same level. He's playing as, um, as Doomsday, so... As you can see here, I'm using the gas tanks. I really like using all of the uh, interactables that I can. And uh, just they, they can just really help you a lot. Like if you hit all three of those gas barrels, or whatever you want to call them, um, you, it takes out a lot of their damage. And if you hit them at the start of the match, then it's just, it takes out a lot of their health. And then you've still got full health. Um, I don't really see, I think, uh, in maybe in like an update or something, they should change that to where if it's a really big character, like, Doomsday or say like Bane or somebody, if they're ducking, this stuff should still hit them because they're huge. And uh, I mean, it like goes through them, but because they're ducking, it misses them. But I mean, like, uh, you saw you saw me shoot arrows at the start of this game, and he was ducking, so they missed him, yet they went like through his head, which, like, I know it because they're ducking, you should miss them, but they're huge characters, so I mean. I don't really see how that works. But here I'm getting my fire arrows, and they do a good amount of damage. And here I think, yeah, I missed the last gas tank, but at least he didn't get to use it. And then uh, I think, yeah, I used the missiles on him, but he jumps over it. But I knock out his shield here, and then I think I hit him with the finisher, yeah. And it misses. <laughs> but I do win this match in the end. I really start lagging at the end, and I'm not sure if it helps me or hurts me, but you'll see what I mean. Uh, the missiles help me a lot. They take out a good amount of damage, and it's it seems like a lot of people like don't jump over it or find it hard to jump over them. But as you can kind of see here, I think I was picking up a little bit of lag, but the real lag starts after this, after I hit this missile, and then I hit the arrow, and then I move up here and get some real big lag. So I hit the missile, and then right here, I, oh, I, I, I just completely lied to you. I'm very sorry. That was in a different match. 
I just hit him with the arrow, so the arrows can be very helpful. I mean, 8% damage is a good amount, but that is about it. I just kind of rambled on, but thank you for watching, <coughs> and, I, and I am going to keep doing these Injustice episodes. I'm going to be doing two, uh, two games per video, I guess. That will be about five minutes, but thank you for watching, and comment, rate, and subscribe for more.